Hello and welcome to the Irish Writers' Centre 2021 Novel Fair Online Information Session. My name is Anthony Glavin, novelist, short story writer, a former editor of New Irish Writing in the Irish Press, a former commissioning editor of New Ireland Books, and one of the judges in seven of the previous novel fairs, which began back in 2012. My aim today is to give a short account of the genesis of the novel fair before proceeding to eligibility criteria and a general overview of the 2021 novel fair submission process with its sequence of events and key dates, as well as the rewards for those long-listed and short-listed both, while also answering some of the frequently asked questions about the novel fair. Described by the Irish Times as a dragon den for writers, the Novel Fair is an Irish writer initiative launched in 2011 with the first fair taking place in 2012. Designed to introduce up-and-coming writers to top Irish and UK publishers and literary agents, the fair offers novelists the opportunity to bypass the slush pile by enabling them to pitch their novel and place its synopsis and sample chapters directly into the hands of the aforementioned publishers and agents. What's more, this year we're introducing a new online submission process via Submittable, which will make it easier for aspiring novelists from around the world to submit for the opportunity to be fast-tracked into the Irish and UK publishing world. I'm going to talk now a little bit about the eligibility criteria. The competition is limited to unpublished novelists over 18 years of age who have not signed with any agents or publishers. Applicants who have already had a novel accepted by a publisher or have a previously published novel will not be eligible. A published novel is defined as one that has an ISBN. And any applicants who subsequently sign with an agent or publisher before the novel fair has taken place are required to notify the Irish Writer Centre immediately. However, if an applicant has a self-published work of fiction with an ISBN, then all of the following conditions will apply, which the applicant must be able to provide evidence of upon application. The work submitted to the Irish Writer Centre Novel Fair cannot be the self-published novel. That is, the Irish Centre Novel Fair will only accept new original work. The applicant can have a maximum of one self-published novel, which must not have sold more than 1,000 copies through any medium, be that print or an e-book. In the process of publication, the applicant cannot have successfully engaged with or had access to a professional publisher, distributor, or editor. The published work cannot have been reviewed professionally, that is, by any recognized print or broadcast media or online review. And finally, novellas, short stories, memoirs, or works of non-fiction will also not be considered for the fair. I'm going to talk now a little bit about the process of the fair itself. Firstly and foremost, submissions for Novel Fair 2021 are now open and will remain so until Friday the 25th of September 2020 and the entry fee for applications is 55 euro which cannot be refunded. However, there is a special entry fee rate for members which can be accessed by an email link which will be provided by the Centre. Applicants are required to send in a synopsis of a maximum 300 words and up to five chapters of their novel, which should number 10,000 words plus or minus 10%. Applicants should bear in mind that a synopsis differs from a blurb and why no novelist wants to give away its ending, some sense of the narrative's conclusion might also be included. You might also have your characters' names in bold format. A submission of random chapters from your novel is also not advised, as the judges may not get a proper sense of the storyline nor characterization. Please submit your application via Submittable. Simply visit the Irish Writer Centre website at www 
writerscenter.ie, click on what's on, and then click and then click on the link for the novel fair in order to submit your manuscript. However, you will also need to create a submittable account if you do not already have one. You will also be able to pay the submission fee here. There is a limit of one entry per applicant. Entries are welcome from anywhere in the world. However, in order to be eligible, applicants must be available to attend the full day of the fair on Friday the 12th of February 2021. Once again, before entering the competition, please ensure that you have carefully read the Novel Fair Terms and Conditions on the Irish Writer Centre website, as the fair is open to aspiring, previously unpublished novelists only. Once the submissions are to hand, they will be divided up between the three judges, who will then read their respective tranches in order to create a long list of a dozen entries from each judge. Each judge will then proceed to read a further 24 entries as chosen by their two fellow judges in order to submit a final short list of 12 entries each. Once the three short lists are to hand, the judges will meet up at the Irish Writers' Centre in order to select 12 novel fair winners and a dozen highly commended long listees runner-ups from the remaining 24 entries. I'd like to talk now just a little bit about the Novel Fair winners and highly commended process. The dozen Novel Fair successful applicants will be notified of their success by email on Friday the 4th of December 2020, at which time they will have five days to submit the entire novel via Submittable and to commit to participating in the full day of the fair on Friday the 12th of February 2021. The dozen winners will also take part in a novel fair prep day on Saturday the 30th of January 2021 on which more of shortly. The dozen highly commended applicants from the shortlist will in turn each receive a 250-word reader's report from the judges, with feedback from their novel's synopsis, storyline, plot, structure, authorial voice, degree of originality, characterization, setting, and more. I'd now like to talk a little bit about the Novel Fair Prep Day and the Novel Fair Day process itself. The Novel Fair Prep Day will commence at 10.30 a.m. on Saturday, the 30th of January, 2021, with the Irish Writer Centre Programming Officer Betty Stenson, who will give a brief welcome from the Centre and then proceed to tell how high the standard was, along with the overall number of entries and a brief history of the novel fair. Betty will then introduce the three judges, briefly explain the nature of the breakout sessions, before assigning the dozen winning authors to their respective breakout session quartets. From 11 o'clock until 12 o'clock then, the hour-long breakout sessions will be divided up into 15-minute tranches with each author and the judge. Each novelist will be asked in turn to describe their book, its genre, aims, strengths and weaknesses, to which the judge will provide feedback. The judge then sits as a publisher in order to interview each author in turn, effectively asking them to pitch their novel as the other three novelists and authors listen on. Questions might range from what is it that compels you to write, who do you think your readership would be if your novel were to be published, or what books have you recently read, along with further questions on your own novel storyline and so forth. From 12 o'clock to 1 o'clock on the prep day, roundtable discussion will proceed. Betty Stenson will steer with the three judges, also contributing. Topics to be covered would include publishing industry in Ireland, managing expectations, and the what to bring checklist for the novel fair day itself. I'd like to wrap up now with the uh, a brief list of novel fair successes including prizes and accolades 
which would include the likes of the novel Cinnamon Toast by Janet E. Cameron, published by Hachette, The Herbalist by Neve Boyce, Penguin Ireland, which was long listed for the Impact 2015 Award, Beach Exploitation by Kevin Curran from Liberty's Press, Here in No Place by Alan Timmons from New Island Books, The Reluctant Cannibal by Ian Flitcroft from Legend Press, A Model Partner by Daniel Seary from Liberty's Press, Susan Lanigan's White Feathers from Brandon Press. Eggshells by Katrina Lally, Liberty's Press, which won the Rooney Prize for Irish Literature in 2018 and the Lannan Literary Prize for Fiction as well. Death at Whitewater Church by Andrea Carter from Constable and Robinson. Swimming on Dry Land by Helen Blackhurst from Saren Press. Eat the Moon by Breda Joy, Poolbeg Press. The Middle Place by Keelan Ryan, Mercier Press. Big Girl Small Town by Michelle Gallen, John Murray Press. A Quiet Tide by Marianne Lee from New Island Books. Una by Alice Lyons, Lilliput Press. Guard Your Heart by Sue Divin, Green and Heaton, to be published in 2021. Raveling by Estelle Birdie, signed by Lilliput Press from Novel Fair 2020 and to be published. Previous Novel Fair judges have included leading authors such as Nula O'Connor, Sarah Davis Goff, Eilish Nigivna, John McKenna, Andrea Carter, Martina Devlin, Kevin Curran, Neve Boyce, Catherine Dunn, Christine Dwyer Hickey, and Anna Carey. Over the past several years, a wide range of Irish and UK publishers and agents have attended the fair, including Penguin Random House Ireland, Hachette Ireland, Transworld Ireland, Curtis Brown, New Island Books, O'Brien Press, Brandon, Lilliput Press, Tramp Press, The Book Bureau, John Murray, Tinder Press, Marianne Gunna Connor, Literary Agency, Jonathan Williams, Literary Agency, Lisa Richards, Agency, Feldstein Agency, and Authors Rights Agency, as well as New York based agent Regal Hoffman and Associates. Should you have any queries as you prepare to submit, do not hesitate to contact the Irish Writers' Centre via novelfair at writercentre.ie. You might also take a look at our Novel Fair 2020 video to get a flavour of just how exciting this event can be. Before I close, I'd like to now answer a number of your own questions. How far along does my novel have to be to enter? I am only a fifth of the way through my first draft. Well, you need to have 10,000 words written in order to enter. Will I hear from anyone after I have submitted? You will receive an automatic email reply when your payment and manuscript have been received. How will I know if I were successful? The Irish Writers' Centre will send you an email on Friday the 4th of December 2020 with those joyful tidings. Do you have up until February 2021 to finish the novel? No, you can enter the novel fair with the first 10,000 words. However, if you are shortlisted, you will need to submit the completed novel of at least 50,000 words within a week of being notified on Friday the 4th of December 2020. However, you will have until the novel fair on February the 12th, 2021 to edit it before meeting the publishers. What will happen for the winners on the novel fair day itself? Each shortlisted writer will be given a series of 15-minute sessions in which to pitch their novel to top Irish and international publishers and literary agents. 
To get a further sense of the format and proceedings at the fair, please have a look at the video of Novel Fair 2020 to 2020, which can be found on the Irish Writers Centre website. Can you apply to the Novel Fair only once or multiple times? You can apply to the Novel Fair each and every year if you wish. Can I enter if I have published a short story or an essay or an anthology? Yes, in all of these cases you would be eligible. Can I submit more than one work? No, only one submission per year per writer is allowed. Are there editing opportunities afterwards if a publisher is interested in your work? Yes, this can generally be agreed between yourself and the publisher. Does it matter that a person is in their 50s and is writing for the first time? Not at all. There is no upper age limit in submitting to the novel fair and no previous writing experience is required. Consider also the magnificent Nobel Prize winning Portuguese novelist José Saramago, who did not achieve widespread recognition and acclaim until he was in his 60s. Can I submit a novel from Australia which has intergenerational thematic links to Ireland and the UK? You can and you should submit a novel from anywhere with its own global thematic links as long as it is written in English. And finally, all of us here at the Writers' Centre sincerely wish all of you who intend to enter the novel fair nothing but the best of luck. And thank you.